Hello there, I am playing Salt and Sanctuary, and um, no, I didn't, I didn't really do an intro, you know, like I've been doing that bottle thing, you know, whatever. Um, I just, I read a note on the ground just now, because I was gonna, I was gonna do some prep work, because I feel like I'm getting close to a boss, and I've got 8,000 gold, I was just gonna go buy a bunch of bolts, <laughs> honestly I was, and then not say anything about it, but the bottle on the ground here said, secret right, examine it. And my god, that was the best worded thing ever, because I pressed the B button, the examine button, apparently, and it opened up. So now I actually get to see a secret. Which is really exciting. Nope, never mind, it's, it's not exciting anymore. Never mind. <laughs> it's, it's nothing. I, I, I'll get there eventually, maybe? I don't know. It's still sick to see, though. Now I know what happens when I see one of those messages that says secret examine... Look around, you know? So, you know, that's good. So maybe there's one here. There's not. Anywho, yeah, no, I'm gonna go buy some bolts and get back to the whatever place. Oh, wait, no, there's an obelisk here. I mean, of course I knew that. That's why I, that's why I went here. It's hard to see. Oh, no, that's nothing. All right. This. Oh, and this is the treasure. Beautiful. I spent, like, forever trying to get here. Onyx stuff. Onyx sounds heavy, doesn't it? Um... Is it? Yes, Onyx is heavy. Alright. Even still, yeah, whatever. I, I want to get rid of my money. I do. Any way I can. I just, I can't hold on to it any longer. So, give me a bit. Alright, I'm back at the, um, elevator spot, and I just saw it go up, so it's still working, which is beautiful. I, um, hate to admit, but it did, I... A little rusty, maybe, took a couple hits, so I had to rest once, because of my attempt to get here. Just because they did not make it easy at all. Those darn hatchet guys hit for so much. Anywho, the reason I think it is a boss here... It's because of this guy. This is the dragon guy. I definitely think that's what I'm getting into. He's not going to kill it himself, as much as I hope he will. So I'm thinking that's that's what it is, and I'm scared. But, gosh darn it, I'm going to do it. Also, um, I decided to get bolts. As you can see, they, it's gone up by a considerable number. And I've also decided to get flame bolts. A little pricey, but I thought... You know, for the one enemy that's resistant to poison, I'll have flame. I mean, I doubt a dragon would be weak to flame, but um, I don't know that it's a dragon, to be fair, so you never know. Um, God, I just wish I had some sort of sanctuary, some sort of rest spot, because that trip is not fun. And I think I've gotten really lucky in past bosses in that I've found a really close sanctuary. But now it looks like I'm gonna have to do the walk of shame, where I'm gonna take a bunch of hits and waste a potion on the way. Wait, what's that? Marion Fire Pot? Why is that equipped? I thought that was a like, um, crafting thing. A clay pot made er, of Marion Fire. The recipe for true Marion Fire is a closely guarded secret. The stuff in this pot is probably only a close approximation of it. I'm guessing it enchants my weapon with fire? They could have said that a little more clearly, but that's fine. And sack of salt. Oh, so that's, um, even more salt than a pouch, I guess. Or a bag. Or a bundle. <laughs> Lots of different kinds. I should be using those, because I know there's times when I've said, oh, if I just had a little more salt, then I should have probably gone for that. Um, anywho. Also, I can't believe how long it took me to realize pressing B at a secret spot would open up the secret, but whatever. Anywho, um, for now, I'm gonna unequip these. I want to be fully prepared on my Water of Blessing for this fight. Eesh. Um, gosh darn, I don't feel prepared in the slightest, but I don't even know it's here. I should just check it out, just to see what's happening. Oh, and there's enemies. So maybe it's not. I'm just overthinking this. I mean, it's good to know there's things that I can screw up in between here and the boss fight if this is leading to a boss fight. Whoops. There we 
go. Stone guide, that's nice. Oh, I think these are mages. I have no idea still. I have not gotten close enough to one for it to even register to me. Like, honestly, even attacking them with a bolt like this, they don't even register. They just say, oh, no, he registered. He's teleported now. He's a mage. He's definitely a mage. Oh my goodness. Don't do that to me, man. You, you didn't even, you didn't care. You're not going to attack me. You, you're just, he just sensed a threat and thought, you know, maybe if I teleport three inches to my right, the bolts will stop coming. Gosh darn, I'm scared. There's going to be a giant guy in here, isn't there? No? Interesting. I, I've got my eyes sharp for a trap here. It looks like the place, doesn't it? Oh, there's the... Is that... That looks friendly. That, um... The knight told about a, a thief. Are, are you her? You look kind of thiefy. You look cute. Is there any way I can get up there with you? I'm also a thief. If that is any consolation. Don't judge me based on my jester uniform. <laughs> yeah, I promise I'm not a biggest joker as I seem. Can you tell me, is down good or is, is to the right good? She's not even- she's distinctly not looking at me. You'd think she'd just give me a bit of a look, like, oh, hey, hi there. Oh, I think this is back down. I think I saw these elevators. They probably didn't open up to the place that I'm hoping they opened up to, but... No, those doors are still closed. So... Darn it, then. It's right there, that treasure is. Oh, no, I can fall, though. If I time it right, I can get that. Okay. Oh, there. Okay. Little, little bit of a hit. A little bit of a hit there. That's not great. Phoenix. Something. It looked like a spell. Fudge. Oh God. That's not great. I thought it was only. I thought it was coming up. Oh no. That's not too bad. <laughs> it's not that big of a wall. Gosh darn it. How come like my past two deaths have been falling? <laughs> That's. That's that's very shameful. As someone who who prides themselves on their platforming abilities, or oh, whatever, I'll get back there. I didn't notice before, but I missed the treasure down here. Hunter stuff. Oh, that sounds pretty sick. A cloak of a beast hunter. Is it good? It's not bad. It's a little more weighty. Uh, let me check out. Um, rugged leather gloves of beast hunter, their knuckles are studded with heavy iron spikes, rugged leather boots of a beast hunter, hat of a beast hunter, more useful than keeping the rain off one's face during long hunts than for physical protection. Well still, if it looks sick, I mean, come on. It's, it's pretty much better in every regard except for poison and holy. And weight, of course. Um, I could switch, maybe. Oops. As I've yet noticed, I don't think there's a, um, like a set bonus or anything of that kind. I'm a little peeved though, because it seems, yeah, my equipment is over 50%, and I think that, um, I think that's what's weighing me down. It's making me feel a little sluggish. So there we go. That's a little lighter. I'll, I'll keep the, uh, the gloves and the pants. I look pretty sick still. <laughs> I mean, it's, it wasn't a bad look overall, but I, I, I love being fast. Anywho, I'm, whoops, whoops, forgot, I forgot there's a magic person. You know, there's no enemies this way, so I'll just, I'm gonna keep running for it. Hopefully they won't teleport. Hi there, please kill anything that follows behind me, okay? I'm gonna be walking back there after having defeated something cool and then absolutely, um, die. There we go. Oh, okay. No, just drop your things to the floor. That's- you can have them. That's fine. I just wanted the salt back. That's it. I'm never going down there again. Goodness. 
I mean, it's better. I mean, I have more health than I did last time. I've got my salt back. That's something. I just already don't look like the looks of the situation. I would love a shelter, sanctuary, I mean, something. Oh, there we go, beautiful. Cause this means I get my, yes, my red grass and my wraith fangs. Hooray, oh, this is beautiful, but this almost guarantees something horrible, doesn't it? I wonder if I can, oh. No, this is friendly. I was gonna say this is definitely the way to the boss, but it's not. I wonder if I have to go through the boss to get to that... that woman over there. I'd like to talk to her, but... I don't quite know how to. Those doors look dangerous. It's, it's scary because I think this is the background. And I'm about to jump out because there's candles there. Look at it, it's so friendly, but... It's... it's if it's not made a clear distinction between background and foreground, and I'm terrified of that. But that's probably the way to drop down to talk to her, isn't it? There we go. Grasping ring. Oh, isn't that? That's one of the items I could have started with, I think, isn't it? Let me check it out. I might have also forgotten to read, um, uh, Mending Ring, I think, from last time I noticed. So I'll check that out as well. Grasping ring. A painted white ring depicted... Depicting two grasping hands on the continents, a ring such as this would symbolize an unending desire. Increased salt obtained from slain enemies. That's pretty sick. What's the other one? Mending band. A metal band dyed red set with a glimmering red gem. The dye is derived from Cadanian Rogelia? Rogella, the fern like plant from which most healing poultices are derived. Regenerate HP? Are you serious? That's amazing! Both of those rings are incredible! What, what garbage do I have equipped? Um, bandage ring reduces wounding effect. I, you know, I'm gonna see what happens when I don't equip that. I wanna see the effects. Because I haven't really noticed it. Willpower is pretty good, endurance is pretty good. Um. I've forgotten which is which, though. Let's let's go willpower. Stick with willpower, and I'm gonna go. How could I not go? Even if it's like the slowest regeneration in the universe, I think it's still worth it. I will wait twenty minutes to have my health restored. It's 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 so worth it. Oh, this is back to her. How do I get to you? It's got to be through that boss fight, and then she's gonna give me something that's gonna allow me to continue the game or something. And you, then beautiful. I was thinking I'd have to uh, make my way from that place of Devara, but no, I get a shrine, so I get my wraith fangs. I mean, there's no enemies on the way to the boss fight. They've done this nice. I, I'm honestly, given that it's it's such an unfriendly game, I thought they would have a total like long walk of shame, but no. Beautiful then, I can just retry and retry, slam my face into this, it's gonna be gorgeous. But it's, I mean, it's definitely a boss fight. I do wonder though, like, um, all of them so far, as I've seen, have had candles next to them. With a number of candles out, or on, or whatever, that, if you have a pessimist, I guess. But, why? Why, like, is it determining that I've got two bosses left? I highly doubt that. But maybe, I, I don't know. Fudge, whatever, I'm rambling because I don't want to start it, but here we go, and I'm sorry if I get quiet, but... And you know, my first attempt at a boss is always just absolutely abysmal. And then I just end up shutting up because I think, well, I'm gonna cut this bit out, and then, I, and then I can do it. That's totally it. It's um, stage fright, so... Here we go. No notes, I see, so that's pretty good. No warnings like, hey, watch out, equip your best yada yada defense. Oh, good. A kraken worm. Oh, that's nice. Are those wings that I see? Are you a dragon? I think you're a dragon. I, I, if I've seen a dragon, it's you, man. Oh. Oh, god. Oh, god. I notice you're not taking a lot of poison. Hits. God! Quite a tail! Quite a tail. Quite a tail you've got. Alright, no, that's good. 
That's not that's good. <sighs> he was not he, in like two damage per hit there, and he never seemed to gain the poison effect, which is something I rely on. Fudge! I don't, should I? I doubt fire. If he's throwing fire at me, I doubt fire would do it. But the only other bolt is poison. I mean, I love my ray fangs. I will forever love them and use them, of course, but maybe they're not useful here? I don't know. Another try. I'm so bad at using health potions mid-fight. I'm bad at it. Because I always try to find a perfect opportunity, and I always see myself using them <laughs> while I'm actively getting hit. And it's it's so cringeworthy just to see me, like, not even try to dodge a hit. But there's no perfect opportunity to eat it. I take like 10 minutes just to chug this thing down. Oof, whatever. Try it again. God, that tail. Oh, he's flying now? That hardly seems fair. What? How am I supposed to avoid that? Oh, God. Okay, he's flying to the left, to the, from the left to the right. At least it gives me opportunity to heal. Where is he? There he is. Okay, no, no, he went to the- so, so I took the full effect of the fire. He took his sweet time. And I, I didn't even get my salt back. You know, that's fine. I don't even care, it means he's easier this time around, right? Gosh darn, though. He went to the right, so he sprayed fire all over me. Thought I outsmarted him. So it doesn't matter, he, he'll just fly to whatever side he flies to. And then I've just got to know? How do I know which side to go to so I don't take the full brunt of the fight? Maybe I stand in the middle of the map and then roll in the opposite direction. Because if I'm on the edge, then... Yeah, maybe he'll do just a short burst? I don't know. Alright, this guy is eating my lunch. I think I'm going to switch to some fireproof armor if I can find some, because that is obviously the thing to do here. And Right, my jester armor doesn't have good fire defense. Maybe that's that's the why that's why I'm dying. That's it. That's the only reason I'm sure of it. <laughs> oh, the pumpkin's pretty good. Hundred and one. See if I just stuck with my normal armor, I could probably would have done great. But I don't know. I'm doing something wrong. Obviously, he's very hard. But I, th I think he made me immune to poison, because I keep throwing my daggers at him, and he he just takes it. It's fine. It's whatever. Right, I've got my ring as well, so I should be better at fire now, at least, but still. God, he just eats my lunch. It's horrible. Huh. <sighs>
Eat it, you big joker. Eat it. Oh, that's that. That feels so good. You loser. Oh my god. Now, that, my daggers are very important to that. I didn't realize that my crossbow was like a pea shooter on this guy. Evidently, that's that's the case here. Oh, I didn't even see what I picked up. I don't even care. If that was for nothing, honestly, just the reward is enough. My heart is beating so fast. Oh my goodness, my hands are shaking. That was, that was triumphant. I really should go back to my shrine before I lose all my souls. Salt, sorry, but I have to see. What did I earn from that? What area? I, I don't know how to get up there. Oh, here she is. You better give me something, all right? Jagged key. I think I saw a door in here somewhere. Oh, hello. Why am I just sitting here? I'm the best thief in the Eight Kingdoms. All right. Not that I'm a thief or anything, but what can a thief do against a dragon? A dagger against worm scale? No. Okay. All right. You want to see what I just did? Do you want to see what I just did? I'm so I'm, I'm a bit of a I'm, <laughs> I'm kind of bragging right now, but I think it's justified. I feel so sick with myself. I am really happy. I. The daggers worked fine, all right? You didn't even try, huh, best thief? I don't think so, miss. But, yeah, no, keep going on. Yeah, sorry. So I just sit here. I did it. I did it, all right? You, you've you slain the dragon? Yes, I have, with daggers, all right? Well, if you've done that, maybe someone like me can slay mighty monsters as well. Here, take this brand. It'll hurt, but it's a tool crucial to a thief. Oh, beautiful. Please, please, anything. I'll take it. What is it? This branding system is really cool. I know it's like a movement thing, I bet. Shadow Flip brand? What does it do? There's treasure in the heart of this island, and it'll be mine. Just you wait. I want it as well, actually. Oh, nothing else? Please, okay. Shadow Flip really sounds like a double jump, and I'm really excited if that's the case. Please, because these are too high for me to jump, I'm thinking. No, that's not what it is. What is it? I was really hopeful I'd just called it, but I don't think I did. Can I get some explanation? Can I s what, what did it do? These are spells. What? What shadow flip? What? What? It said crucial to a thief. What is it? Sh what is shadow flip? Come on. Maybe it'll, you know, when I reach an obelisk, maybe I can only use them then. Is, is there any way I, I can look at my beast area? I don't think that's it. Menu, no. I don't think I can look at my brands, can I? Is there? I don't think so. Oh, I... I didn't even know I have a devotion to the stone roots. I don't know what that does. Any, I can't... I don't know. What shadow flip? It's gotta be for something cool, right? It's it's gotta be... Oh, there we go. It's in the light. Didn't even notice there's another freaking thing for it. Alright, so... Um, shadow flip brand. A lot of power carried in a brand. Bearing the brand grants one its owner... Or, okay. Grants its owner sh mastery of shadows. Wearing this brand to gain the ability to perform wall jumps. Press A while wa jumping towards a wall. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And that's almost as good as double jump. Is it here that I can... Oh, that's that's a good one. That gives a bit of a boost there. Impen's charm. It seems as if there's a... It, can I? Is that jumpable? Nope, not jumpable. It looks shadowy, though. I wonder if the, a later brand will allow me to jump on that. What is that? It, it looks... Because there's treasure up there. And there's a cla... Whatever. Anywho, that's that's beautiful. What is the Impen brand? Mm, or Impen charm, I mean. A uh, burnt wooden charm adorned with a crest of Impen. The mythical kraken of flame. It's colder than it seems like it should be. Adds fire damage to your attacks? I gosh darn wish I could use those. I still haven't figured out how. Granted, it took me until this part to realize how to get into those secret areas that I keep seeing messages for, so I'm learning all the time. Anywho, gosh darn, I'm still riding on that high, but that was, that was, um, I'm gonna cut out like 8 billion of those attempts, but that took a while, so I think I'm gonna cut it here. Sorry if that is short or long, I don't actually know. That's it.